I'm forgetting something. It's fine. It's fine. I'm getting it out. Don't worry about it. Hello, everyone. And Karai, thank you for another gift. Starting out strong with a with a with a classic uh, cough. It's fine. Hi everybody. 
How is everyone doing? Welcome to Friday! We're chilling. Hi, Jay. Hi, Star. Hi, MJ. Hey, Karai. Hello, hello. Hello, everyone. You guys ready to game? I'm like pretty much 100% better now. More or less. If I do uh, aggressive activities, I, I cry. But, you know, it's fine. Hey, Blackout. Hi, Spoops. Thank you. Your legs are sore from being in the car for nine hours? Yeah, that happens. You gotta uh, stand up. Do some stretching, you know? Bow, bow. Bow. Oh boy, oh boy, okay. We're gonna be doing more ferrying today, as as we do. Oh, 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 oh. Wait, it might just be the one. Wait, no, that's the outro, stop! Sorry, sorry, that was the outro. <laughs> We're not there yet. Let me turn this up, there we go. There we go. All right, before we hop into it, news. <laughs> Run through of the, the news. I am live today instead of yesterday because yesterday I tried to make fried chicken and then found out that uh, an air fryer and a pressure cooker are not the same thing. But, you know, we learn things. You know, we learn something new every day. Truly. It's fine. Yeah, I had to cancel stream because cooking took 8,000 times longer than I thought because I didn't know that pressure cookers and air fryers were not the same thing. But now we know. <laughs> listen, 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 listen. I just thought that they were the same thing. You know, I, I, I had no reason to think that they weren't the same thing. You know, I, I guess that's on me. You know, it happens. Happens to the best of us, I suppose. Um. Yeah, so I had to cancel stream because then I had to actually cook things. Oh, you're gone for three weeks. Have fun at camp, though. <laughs> no, Wilbur was literally like, you're so, you're so dumb. And I was like, haha, but I'm cute. <laughs> uh, yeah, so that happens. Um, also, we, the, the plane tickets to TwitchCon in the bag, in the bag. I should make sure those actually processed. Actually, I'll do that right now. In the bag, chat. It's it's real. Like it was already real because we booked the hotel, but like we've are we've now we've paid money. Like money money. It has in fact not processed yet, but that's fine. The charge is there. But it's fine. Yeah, okay. I'm trying to think. Any other announcements? No. I mean, possibly... The face cam will happen in a week or two? Maybe two weeks? I hope you can come, Jefferson. Mr. J. Little, little J. Come hang out with us. Bill's kicked your butt and you had to dip into the Twitch count savings. No! Oh, no. Good luck, Karai. You got it. You got it. <laughs> yeah, we'll start. We'll do a little bit of gaming. Yeah, it's gonna be fun. Oh my God, Cry, if you come, please bring baked goods. Oh my, I would die. I would die for baked goods. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's shopping time. Let's go. Oh, also, I don't know that I told you guys this time, but uh, Will and I might be getting a little kitty in uh, like a week or two. Big things coming in the next couple weeks. Go, go take a look. I should have it here. Get the nicest chocolate box you see. Yes, yes, yes. Not the cheap stuff, of course. Brand new shipment. Things are looking up for Theodore. What the? I have to pay for it? You're telling me I have to pay for his gift? He's he's giving it to somebody else and I have to pay for it? This is some bull honky. Also, the game feels a little loud to me. I 
That's a little bit better. I have to pay for the chocolate. This is bull. This is this is fake. Okay, I don't need any of this. Do I have stuff to sell? I don't think so. No. Who are you? Maybe I'll cook something for you later. Yep, yep, yep. Cool, got it, got it, got it, got it. Haha, -ha, I knew I could count on you. You're terrific, Bambina, you know that? Marvelous, exceptional, admirable. One second. Ba, ba, ba. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. We don't deserve you. Nope. No one does. Okay, let's pack it up, guys. We don't deserve Stella one bit. You wonderful little peanut. All right, now give it to me, please. Haha, mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, she'll love it so much. I'll hold on to it. Let's head back to the boat, Bambina. Ah. <sighs> Is there other stuff here that I'm supposed to do? They won. Stole the key. Pro does leave without <laughs> teach him a lesson. I won't give it up for nothing. Maybe a little bag of glims up front. Yeah, I'll take it. One key to the CEO's office. Hey, yo. Two steaks tonight. Nice. Unions forever. So true, bestie. I just love working. Been there. Take that, you capitalist pig. So true, bestie. Can I get in there? Nope, it's locked. <coughs> Hooray, true. Oh, nothing to say, that's all right. gotta explore while we're here you know i can't wait for our next game my friend buck has been preparing a new game for us i'm sure he'll tell us soon interesting what's up with you take out mexican Ooh. me and wilbur had wontons and fried rice picking up some ore nice Might as well, you know? I think I can get in the boss's office now. Yeah! Oh. Thanks for unlocking the door. I actually just went in the corner there. Sorry for the oh. smell. Here's a little something for your troubles. Those protesters, I mean, oh. workers. I have to get used to that. Oh, he paid me! He paid me so many dollars. Let's go! Hmm. So how do I get up there? I don't know. If only he paid his workers. True? True, though? Like, bestie. <clears throat> We're back. Alright. Let's do a bit of farming. We do a little farm time. One of those already. Okay. Okay, let's see. What do we got going on? We need the desk. Which means we need aluminum. We don't got that yet. Uh, fried chicken, still working on that. I don't know how to get fat. Orchard. I keep calling, I want to call it an orchid and it's just not. We need the nebula thread, which means we need to say hi to the, the little bug things, I think. Negative 150, 150? Uh, Albert. And we need to go to Albert's. Okay. 
We'll take a little nap. Nice. Okay. Oh, wait. Also... Oh. Uh, we don't have this stuff yet. Sip line, lost bounty. Okay, yeah, we're chilling. We're chilling now. Okay, I don't think we can get through this yet. We can get through the ice, but not anything else. We do need to go to Albert's. Okay, I guess we'll go to Albert's first since it's right here. Bright red hair dye and black nail polish. Funky. Nice. I need to get a haircut. And I think I... I'm going to dye it again. Go more. Go, go blonde again. What do we got in here? What were we cooking? I forget. Coal. Did I do that? Okay, I have to keep one. The fried chicken. Good morning! We do a little hug. Yes, nice. And we do a little munching. Hello, you two. Ah, 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 let me down. Almost missed it. I said, please let me down there. <laughs> planks, get your planks. He made me some planks. Thank you, bestie. Start with a little hug. Then we do a little munching. Then Summer's still down for the count. We need Giovanni. Where is he? Oh, there he be. He be taking a little nap up here. Oh, I cannot talk to him. That's fine. I'm not really sure why talking to Albert <laughs> will um, wake up Summer, but you know, why not? We also need to head back to that one place on the left. I don't remember them. We'll see. Pretty sure we're basically there now. Let me in. Hug daffodil. Oh, Giovanni needs something. What's up? What's up, bro? Peanut. I was thinking, and you know what? Just a chocolate box is nearly not enough for a lady of this caliber. But I know exactly what could complement this gift. A nice bouquet of flowers. Vibrant. Luscious roses. And I know just where to pick some. Ambertown Park. Don't worry, I'll show you once we're there. Mm -hmm. It's a great idea, eh? It's definitely a great idea. And again, mm -hmm. not a word. She will be completely surprised. New destination. More requests. Hello, Albert! Oh, I don't know that face! It's about that house, the Reed and Brahma, right? I have some sort of problem with it, don't you? Yeah, I could see it from a mile away. Listen, I know my job. Me and the boys, we're real professionals. 
It's not often that we criticize another work for craftsmanship. But that house? Oh, wow. I built that house. What the heck? Had to be the worst job I've ever seen. So consider this a lesson. Don't just trust any old amateur. Always go to a professional. So tell me, what complaints does your passenger have? She's sleeping. Oh, of course. That bald head of hers is very sensitive to temperature changes. Imagine how cold she must be. Not mentioning her dry and scaly skin. No, no. She needs a temperature and humidity control system. Luckily, that place was so shoddily designed that there's ample cracks for wiring and electronics. So, yeah. There you go. Some plans and schematics for a nice all-in-one HVAC system. Pro quality. Code of courtesy, after all. How can you repay your debt if your boat falls to pieces? Oh, okay. Well, okay. Back we go then, I guess. So can I just like make it or? Why can't I? There it is. Ash planks, zinc ingots. Ain't got none of that. Oh, that's a lounge. Wait, where's the HVAC system? Is that an improve? It might be an improvement. Iron and copper. I don't have any iron right now. We need to go to that quarry. Yeah, summer's hibernating. Okay, we need to go to the quarry. Um, which is over here, isn't it? Yeah. I'm thinking we just, like, pop over to this bus stop. And we take the bus. Listen, places to be, people to see. No need to be out in the water for 8,000 hours. What's up? He said, Peanut, what's up? After the war, I opened a tavern? Working in sales wasn't my thing, and Astrid's mother said she wanted to help us, so I told myself, hey, sure, why not? It was a reputable establishment, something fancy. Not a drinking hole where people would come to forget about their lousy lives. So one day, a client comes in, disheveled, obviously distraught, looking over his shoulders as if the dogs of Inferno were after him. He runs to the bar, grabs me by the collar, and tells me in a panic, 12 shots of your finest liquor! Before I even have the time to come back with the bill, he's almost through half of them. So I ask him, brother, what's going on with you? Why are you drinking so fast? To which he answers, if you had what I have, you would be drinking very fast too. Surprised and a bit scared, I thought I'll ask him, what in heavens do you have? He then stands up right away and tells me, only 50 cents, and dashes through the door. Well, Peanut, it's been 40 years, and I'm still laughing at this one. That's interesting. Hello, my little friend! Music? You don't like my music, really? You really want me to stop my wonderful music? No. It was about a break! Good one! <gasps> Sinko! Hi, Sin! Okay, we gotta go over here. He's a little sea lion. Nice. Now we do a little bit of zooming. I feel like, are we working on the spirit at Mount Toriyama? Susan's Museum. I can't go there yet. I don't know. I don't remember. Um. 
Okay, so we're gonna stop here because I think I need some of that nebula wool. Bye, Alex. See you around, bestie. Hello? Let's replant. Alrighty. Nice. Yeah. A casserole. Funky. Yeah, sure. Ba, 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 ba. Is there a way to see like completed things? Okay, is it is it nebula time? Can I get the nebula fibers? You question some of these recipes? Who are you? How do I wake him up? Are you coming down to help me with this guy? <gasps> yes! Oh, you're tired, aren't you? Of course, so many children are bound to leave you exhausted. Maybe we could play with them a bit, let you rest. Hi, Maddie! Oh. What do you think, Stella? Yeah! Oh, wonderful, we'll have so much fun. I used to play this game with my grandchildren all the time. Just catch them and bring them back to their mommy. Ah! Oh! Uh, catch, catch. Oh, I have to do one at a time? Okay. One, two, three, four. Get them. Get him. Get all the little guys. Come here, bestie. Here, I got some babies for you. Is that all of them? Nice. Now we can make the... We can make it! Let's go, dudes. Perfect. Okay, hold on. How, do I need the, the fabric or the thread? Okay, we can build the orchard now. Uh, I'd like to put it there, I think. Actually, yeah. Let me just put this here and then do a little bit of editing. Hold on, let me just, uh, let me get a... Perfect. I want them to fit side by side, but they don't. Okay, perfect. What else do we need? I don't have aluminum. <coughs> Chicken coop. Wool, copper, ash. I, don't, I only have make and oak. Pulsar? Yeah, that's not gonna happen. Uh, we don't need anybody else's house. Ooh, I need a bunch of nebula fab. Although, I don't really need an air draft. I don't really care f that much for it. And then for the improvements... I need- I don't have aluminum. Comet powder? I don't know how to get that. <laughs> Aluminum. Iron and copper. We already did that. Fire glow. I do not know how to get that. Ash. Iron. Clear glass sheet. <laughs> nah, I don't know how to get that. 
Okay, we actually might be chilling right now. I thought we needed more. I thought we needed the nebula stuff for more than that, but maybe not. Oh, wait. It's the, um... No, not that. Huh, interesting. Wait, what do I need for the HVAC? Oh, iron. That's why we're going to the quarry. Off we go. We do a bit of watering. Where is Alice? Oh, she's probably asleep now. Tragic? That'll work. Corn and cabbage. Nice. We need to sell to the, uh, the onion soon. Come on, Daffodil, it's nap time! Bedtime! Little sleeping! Little time for sleeping! Wakey, wakey! Nope. Simply not what I was going for. <clears throat> nice. We made it. Good morning! Oh, hungry! Okay! <laughs> Hold on, let me go say hi to everybody else. Hello, Atul! Good morning! Fair enough. Still napping. Oh, Stella, you've built an orchard. And it looks almost exactly like the one my husband built. Have you seen all these fine details? Yes, he was quite the woodworker. At least until his hands gave up on him. We planted our first apple tree along with the birth of our first daughter. You should plant a tree for yourself. Of course, it'll take some time before it can bear fruit. But once grown, it makes you feel so proud. Accompanies you your whole life. Oh, listen to me rambling again. I'll get out of your things now. She's hungry. She's hungry. I have I have food. Oh, and a hug and a hug, of course. Let's do an apple tree. Cherry tree. It's just like Animal Crossing! Okay, is Giovanni still on his fucking- Okay, he's still napping. It's fine. It's fine. It's quarry time. Sinkle! I can't believe Sinkle's here. Oh my gosh. What a great day. In we go. Can we kick Geode off the boat? Unfortunately, I don't think we can. Although 10 out of 10 people agree, Geode should not, should not be on the boat. I need iron. <gasps> Thank you, Sika. Oh. 
this is gonna be a long one. Uh, more slate. It's fine. Uh. Oh, the zip lines. I can't zip line yet. Yeah, Wilbur tried to convince me not to stream today, but I was like, listen. Oh, finally some iron. Let's go. Right, I already went that way. Huh. I was like, listen, Wilbur, the people need me. Hi, Taco! Good, we got more iron. What the heck? for the gift to taco to whoever gave it thank you oh, mushroom plus we love seeing all the little soup cans what's in here Ooh, a field upgrade Ooh, funky that's exciting over here. Perfect. More iron. That's what we need. Oh, chat. So, I'm sure that y'all remember Mount Chicken took us, like, literally five or six months to finish that build on the modish SMP. They reset the server. It's gone. Mount Chicken doesn't exist anymore. They deleted the server. Like, they they wiped it to make it a 1.19 server. It's gone. Like, they told me that and I was like, uh, uh. I was like, my heart just got ripped out of my chest. What the heck? Mount Chicken now only exists in our minds and in the VODs. How in the world do I get out of here? It was truly kind of tragic. Yeah, Mount Chicken's gone. It's gone. Literally, how could they do this to us? But no, the giant- This was my stomach. Oh, he's starving. Okay, okay, king. He just doesn't want to eat that. That's fine. I got I got other stuff. Would you like uh fish curry? Nope. He doesn't like carbs. Okay, no carbs. How about he does like caffeine? Okay, we need to well, hello there! I know. Oops. Um. I'd rather keep the jellies. Uh, okay. 
Or I guess we can go to a location and that we can start heading for a new place and then do our cooking. We can't get there. We can go up north. Where's the new place we're supposed to go to? Ambertown. How am I supposed to get to here? We need copper. I think we have copper. I just need to cook it. Wait, do I have copper? Do I have copper in my in my inventory? Bro, how do I get? I've already. I've forgotten how to. Uh, how do I get into my inventory? What? What am I standing on? What? What? Strange. How do I get into my inventory? Chad, I don't- I don't know how to get in there. How do I get in there? I, I mean, I know I can do it from here. Yeah, we have copper. We just have to smelt it. Okay. Um, what do we need? We need to do more exploring, but I don't know where we can go. We can't go this. We can go up north. Mm, can we get through this? I don't remember. What are those coordinates we need to get to? We need negative 150, 150. Oh, we actually might be able to get up here. All right, that's what we're looking for. Yeah, we can probably check out Susan's museum because we can get through the ice now. Okay, we're gonna make our way up up to Susan's museum. So we'll stop here. Have we done the? F oh yeah, no. Okay. Okay, we're gonna get some more nebula fiber and cook our stuff. <clears throat> Alrighty, let's see. I am out of coal. Hello? Oh, I'm not out of coal. Come on, iron, work with me here. Oh, there's a little friend here. Hold on, let me just cook this iron. And then I shall collect your youngins. Don't zone out too hard. We gotta keep an eye on it. Is it still going? I don't know. Is it still going down? Yes, very slowly. She took her hat off. I didn't know that she does that. True? True? Okay, let's get these guys. Oh. Yeah! <coughs> Babies. 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 Baby. Baby. Baby, I see you up there, you hooligan. Nice, nice. Okay, now we're gonna keep going north. Yes, I fetch them, I fetch them. Uh, and we'll go here and we're heading to... 
150, 150. Off we go. No, Sin's right. We fetch the children. We fetch them. Yes, I did a little, did a little go, go get them. Oh no. It's fine. We're, we're chilling. Everything's fine. Chat, me and Sin might do, might do a little, a little raft streaming soon. Mayhaps. 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 We gotta get the we gotta get Sin to affiliate, you know? Oh, we're in the ice now. Yes, mayhaps a little a little raft streaming. Well, no. But we need to get Sin to affiliate before TwitchCon. So Sin needs to do a bit of a little bit of streaming. Which means that Sin needs stuff to do on stream. Oh, this is going really fast, okay. Let me get all this stuff. Is that a crab? A snow crab. Funky. Ooh, an aluminum ore. We need that. Wait, I should I should not smelt it. Give it back. It's too late. I should have I should have put it onto uh one of the one of the turtles. It's too late though. It, uh, I may have uh, already, uh, I may already be smelting it, but it's fine. I'm just a little dumb. <laughs> okay, I don't know how much more we need. Let's find out if we need any more <coughs> to make. I don't even know what we need to make at this. What am, what am I making? I need to do with tools. I need aluminum for that. Oh, I needed it for the HVAC. Yes! We've woken up summer! Have some patience. Uh, I'm just not really good at that, you know? Bright jelly. Oh, we need, we need some... We need some duders, some some jellyfish. Um. <laughs> okay. We can go to bed now. We do a little bit of bedtime. We do a little bit of bedtime. Just my seat. Uh! That was a stretch just for you guys. Just like Stella. Just like Stella. We do be stretching. Appear that Summer would like to talk to me. Let's 
just gotta get some more of the jellyfish. The jellyfish are so annoying to get though. How tragic. That wasn't really what I needed to do, but I needed to do that anyway. Daffodil. Daffodil's just literally the cutest. Just in existence. Yeah, you play with that little orb, bestie. Oh, I need to, and I need to water the trees. Okay, what's up, you? Your kitten? Your kitten? <sighs> Your co-worker's trying to get kittens you rescued, adopted? Oh, nice. Oh, Stella, I think I might have overslept a bit. How long have I been sleeping? What? That much? Hibernating, you say? Well, I guess it was bound to happen. I might have been ignoring what my body was trying to tell me. Bad habit of mine. Thank you, Stella, for taking such good care of me. Susan's museum. So I can hear my stomach. It's restless. Hmm. We got to check on everybody and then we're going to go to the museum. Oh. My stomach is turning. Would you have anything to eat? Oh, uh oh. <clears throat> well, I mean, I mean, if it's requested, you know? <clears throat> here we go, here we go. For, for the, for the redemption, you know how it is. <clears throat> There you go. Why was I frozen like that on the screen? Here you are. Good morning. Ah, she made me some iron. That's nice. That was good. Yeah. Wait, let me let me go back. There we go. <laughs> Is Giovanni taken. Oh, he's awake now. Hello, buddy. Mm -hmm. I do have a snack. Mm -hmm. Aha, now this is something special. Quite the fine dining experience, Bambina. I, Giovanni Leon, formidable am a creature of refined taste, of exquisite complexity. And this, this hits the spot. Delicious. Grazie mille to the chef. Yes, I know it's you. Chad, I may have fully just pronounced it wrong, but you know what? It's too late. I are, I committed. I committed. Got it. You got to respect. Have fun, Sin. Have fun reading your book. Sin has made it so that me and Wilbur have to go to a bookstore tomorrow. It's Sin's fault. We're gonna go get some books. See, because Wilbur is uh, upset that I am missing the first Percy Jackson book and like the fourth book in the Heroes of Olympus series. Aww. A walrus! <gasps> Hello there. Oh, great. Just fantastic. The spirit fairers here mm -hmm. on this god's forsaken rock in the middle of the ocean. I have every other book, just not the first one. She came all the way over here. Mm -hmm. She said the cold, steep surface of the cliffside below with its broken ladder. See, okay, my thing with books is I tend to like read the first book like online or like from the library and then I'm like, oh my God, I love this. And then I buy the rest of them, which means that there's quite a few series where like I don't own the first book, but I own all of the other ones, you know? Yes, how inviting. Surely I am welcomed here. Mm -hmm. Well, you found me. No use to running from it anymore. 
Let me run the old tape for you. Hmm. Spirit fair, whose name I don't know, nor care to know. I am the collector, otherwise known as Susan, the gods, in all of their materialistic arrogance have played a cruel trick on me. You see, I am the collector not by choice, but by duty. Through your ceaseless plunder of this world's very finite wonders, you will no doubt come to stockpile a collection of junk to rival the greatest garbage dumps of history. My duty is to reward this unconscionable behavior with more junk. What irony, is it not? My predecessors used to ask for the accumulated bundles as payment to who to do who knows what with. But the job description says nothing about that, and I certainly have no interest in your filth. So when the time comes, Show me what monstrous assortments you managed to put together, grab your meaningless reward, and leave quickly, and pick up after yourself. The sun is following me. Oh. Never mind. What do you want? Get on with it already? I have to catch- Oh, this is the completionist. I need all the figurines. Why in the name of everything that is holy and beauty do you carry this horrible thing around? It's not only offensive to my eyes, it's the very essence of my soul. But wait, I recognize this. Oh no, I should have known from the very beginning. It's that man, isn't it? Who sent you? That shallow, materialistic, superficial fraud of an intellectual. He sent you here, didn't he? a crooked, treacherous weasel. He's mad about losing his precious little wood print, isn't he? Well, now he's never going to see it again. I can guarantee it. Perhaps he can learn a thing or two about asceticism. As far as this preposterously silly collection, your reward is, let's see. Nope, this can't be. No, the fates can't be so cruel. Well, all right, just take it. Take the bloody wood print. Go back to that blabbering fool. Just just take anything you want and get out of my sight. Nice! <sighs> How do I... Next reward is a blackberry outfit? This time it's fish. Probably won't be able to complete this collection. They're slippery little bastards. Yeah, this purple outfit is a is a is something that I got. Next reward is a diamond. We're gonna get many <laughs> rewards here. Broken shiny rocks. What a joy. Well, you've got a long day ahead of you. Listen, don't let me keep you spirit fair. You've two jobs now. Finding gems and spirits. By the way, who even came up with such a ridiculously sounding name as the spirit bearer? It sounds terrible and doesn't roll off the tongue like my name. Susan. Susan. Susan the Collector. Oh well, halfway there, bright finder of rocks. You must really love the way they look. You are amused by such mortal things. It figures, well, I'm not keeping you, go. More, 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 yeah. More gems, give me the rewards. Do we have more we can trade in? Crusher? I don't even have the Crusher yet. Easter outfit! <gasps> we have to cook! We have to cook more! I want the Easter outfit. It's fine. Again, Stella, I I wanted 
the dream Stella, they're back. So much stronger than I ever thought they could be. These visions. I see them now even as I'm awake. The reefs have turned into wafts of ethyl scented smoke. And the rotten fruit formed into the eye of the dragon. Vitreous and sticky. And a coil of arduous rust. Another dragon has awoken, he scares me. But suffering cannot be allowed. You would agree, I'm certain. Let's go help it, shall we? Okay, we gotta visit another dragon, and we gotta go to, f I think, Furugawa. Yeah, show us more stuff. Ooh, maybe we stop by the pier. Maybe we do a little pier check. Oh, the aluminum dragon! Aluminum, aluminum, aluminum. Okay, we're going lighthouse, or pier, dragon, uh, pier, dragon, and then f I think Furogawa. Yeah. Okay. To the pier chat! Chat, we got an aluminum dragon now. This is great. This is incredible. Perfecto. I do like my little purple outfit though. It's very on brand, you know? We gotta cook, we gotta keep cooking. trees we need a bunch of aluminum let's check out the pier interesting i need to be able to zip line which i actually think i'll be able to do really soon because i'm about to get this uh this one spirit from furogawa and then we should be chilling oh madame you've got that face Larry Salzberg knows faces, and yours could be on a poster, on a billboard. You're not talking, but I can imagine your voice, and I hate it. But we can fix that in post. We'll get one of those girls to dub everything. You'll be perfect. What? You're not an actress? You don't do vaudeville? You've never been with Ziegfeld? Nothing for those French shepherd dresses? She shepherd? Shepherdesses? <laughs> or whatever it's called? That's impossible, you would have been perfect. But if that's true, you're pure undiscovered talent. I must have you in my next picture, I must. I don't have a script nor a director, but that doesn't matter. It will be called something like visions of perfection, a thriller, murder, suspense. Something to get the blood boiling. Something to make the town talk. Talking about my young new star. It will be a box office smash. Can't you see it? I knew I could count on just Walking the streets. You'll be a star in no time or my name isn't Larry Salzburg. Now we need to find you a co-star. My casting director is on her honeymoon with her new boo. Somewhere warm, it doesn't matter. What does matter is this picture I just thought about in the last five minutes. I do need to cast this picture with stars. Star power. This town is drier than my shirts on a clothesline in summer. Let's see. Joan is filming that daughter mother picture. Vivian is out of the question. Judy's off somewhere magical. We'll never find someone with gumption. Gravitas. There's this veteran, Catherine, who would work. Apparently, she's been talking. Taking in nature recently. Somewhere in obscure canopy, I believe. Wait one second. I just had another idea. We could go the demure, naive route. Someone like Ingrid. She could also do justice to our new movie. She just bought a new place in Old Central District. You could go meet her there. Ah, so many possibilities. Casting movies. What a rush. All right, I'll leave you, I'll, I'll leave in your capable hands. Find us a match. Someone that you think will pop on the screen. Um, okay. 
I'm not really sure how this became my job, but you know. Ooh. Something to grab. Money! And now how do I get up there? <laughs> Hmm. Yes. Some lunatic wakes me up every day. He jumps in the water screaming. He always says, oh, what is it? I'm the big fish man or something like that. He's so loud. And it's not just the screaming. It's the thrashing in the water. Poor fellow doesn't even know how to swim. I should close my bedroom window. Maybe not. I came in for the ocean breeze. It came with the early bird swimmer. What? An antique bust. Yes, let me up. Let me up. Yes. Heat treated crap. Interesting. What is this? Why it look like this? Why is it like this? Hello? It does look a little broken. Look, there's... Oh. Gwen. This is a zip line. Where are we going? Interesting. We need a zip line. Which means we need to pick up the spirit in Furugawa. Yeah, we really do be needing to zip line and just are not capable of it right now. Alrighty, time to go back. Then we take a little bit of a nap. We do a little bit of napping. Oh, y'all hear that? Somebody snores. Who's snoring that loud? <laughs> All right. Loneberg. There's a person here. There's a person we need to see here. <coughs> All right, it was Loneberg. Wait, was it? No, obscure canopy or old central district. Okay. Okay, time to go. The dragon. I guess I should wake everyone up. Wakey, wakey! It's time! I have, uh, just so much tea. I need- to, I should definitely make some tea. Hello, Summer. Good morning. Prepared the garden for Rose. I wanted to give her a nook of paradise. A home filled with so much love she would be overwhelmed by it. I was wrong. Incredibly so. When she came to live with me, the garden's yield grew tenfold. It was a sight to behold. She'd never had any formal training, and yet she could always tell which branch was sick and required cutting. Or which plant needed fertilizer, or what crop was about to bloom. I, I've seen her wake up in the middle of the night to cover some delicate flowers. The next morning, a surprise frost would hit the region. She didn't need knowledge. She didn't need my crude tools. Chakras, gems, chants. 
No, she was an open gateway to the universe. Ethereal force. When the dragon came for its final visit, I was not scared anymore. Oh, it's dragon time! I can't get in there because it's dragon time. Nice, nice. Actually, does she need a hug? Mm -hmm. Your internet, your internet pieced out. Rip. Okay, where's my boy? I can't get in there. I can't get inside. Okay. Dragon time! Oh, this. Something smells different, don't you think? Oh, as I thought. Just. Just help it, Stella. Hi, buddy. Time to get some aluminum. Ah, oh, I understand. I was like, I simply can't reach that. Oh, I can't be on top of it. Okay, interesting. Good to know. Hmm. Ah! Uh, how do I get up that high? Ah, oh, there we go. That works. Oh! 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 What just happened? This is the aluminum dragon. Ah, uh, I see. This one? Yeah, this one's about summer as well. What do you need, dragon? Go fast! Off we go. Ooh! Thought we weren't gonna make that jump! Hi, buddy. Incredible. It's... I... I need some time. Sorry. I shall use the time that you need. Oh. Stella the dragon. I thought it was getting tamer. It seemed like we'd finally learned to coexist. To manage, at least. But it's really getting stronger, isn't it? Well, you know what it means as well as I do. It's time for me to go. Please, when you can, bring me to the Everdoor. I'll be fine. No! It's, it's time for Summer to go! <laughs> oh! <coughs> no. Summer. I guess... Go to Furugawa and then, <coughs> and then to the Everdoor, I guess. No, it's time for summer to go. I can't believe it. 
No. Oh. Summer's journey. I know who's gonna sing to the plants. Uh. I smell something burning. Did you forget food in the oven? I've taken it out for you. There you go. Hugs. It's fine. Just cook our aluminum and then keep on, keep on keeping on, I guess. Yeah, we're gonna have to say goodbye to Ashton. We're gonna have to say goodbye to a tool. A big frog friend. <laughs> this is just so sad. check on building bright jelly I need oak I can make oak planks right now I need what five oak time Okay, I don't know how to get him frickin' fried chicken, though. can do the desk can't do that yet and we done all that oh we just need more oak hold on hold on let me just uh let me just uh <clears throat> just do three more we got it we got this Okay. Nice. Okay, we can't do any of that yet. And this we need the jellyfish. I don't have any marble right now. I need marble. And then we're chilling on everything else.
I don't really need an air draft. I'm chilling on that. All right. Oh. I'm not feeling so hot right now. I got a lot on my mind. I keep thinking about my friend Zazzy. Did you ever meet her? We used to organize rallies when we were younger. This picture of her and me is the only picture I have in my wallet. I've had it for over 40 years. Damn. Your Aunt Viv would murder me if she knew I didn't have at least one picture of our kids. And she adored Zaz. Everyone did. Maybe we should hang out in my- Maybe we should hang in my house. It won't get rid of the folds, but at least I won't get water all over it. Don't forget. I know, Bessie. Okay, well. We made it to Furogawa. Let's go talk to that one spirit. <clears throat> it's okay, not yet, cry, not yet. Should get back to it. I don't remember which one I'm supposed to talk to. <coughs> I know, I know. Not yet, though. It's okay. It's okay. Uh -huh. Back again, are you? And would you look at that? You've got the piece! Oh, Stella, this is very good. You've managed to wrestle the woodprint from the cold hands of the hag. What ingenuity! What spunk! Yes, you'll prove to be an immense asset to all my endeavors. Or shall I say, our endeavors? Well, it is decided then. There's no pursuit left for me on this island. Therefore, I will join your little expedition. As a passenger, mind you, not as a crew member. Yes, yes, such a boat might be just be the perfect gallery. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go! Nice, we got a new one. <clears throat> I will not forget you. I don't know if there's anybody else I need to talk to right now. Do I need anything else from here? Uh... No, we're chilling. I'd rather eat mangoes and watch the sunset. Okay, Bestie. Oh, have I been up here? Oh yeah, this was to show you how to do it. Okay. We'll go back now. <laughs> it's okay, Karai. Gotta, gotta say goodbye sometimes. That's okay. Um, all right, all right. I know I can do it. Sure, it might tingle a bit, but... Well, what if it hurts? Ah, uh -huh, here, here, good. Is this a bird? You won't let it be painful, will you? Uh -huh. Okay, I don't really trust you, but what choice do I have anyways? Is this a bird chat? Yeah! Oh, it's an owl! He's a little owl! Uh -huh. Huh! I did it! I didn't even faint! It actually feels alright! Uh -huh. Who knew? 
Well then, let's get started. What? Oh, but of course, pardon my enthusiasm. I forgot to introduce myself. How forgetful and impolite. I'm Gustav. And I don't know why, but I can't exactly shake the feeling that we've met each other already. Anyhow, I'm glad that our paths have crossed on this island. And I know that together, we'll accomplish great things. This world is part wonderful and disgusting. And so is art. Truly, Sela, the gods have struck us with a grand inspiration. It's our solemn duty to elevate souls with beauty and awe. My resolve is strong. Stella, I will put together the greatest exhibit of my life, and you will help me. Oh, how grandiose it will be. Oh, but first, payment. I've been called a lot of things, but never a cheapskate. Zip line! Wait, let me hug him. I do not mind a caring moment now and then. Okay, sleep time! <clears throat> Bisque! Excited. Nothing goes with the strawberries. I know, it's really cute. All right, Chad, it's gonna be time. It's gonna be time to say goodbye. Okay, but where's the zip line? You know, like... Where's, uh... Where's the place we have to go to get the zip line? It's a place with a shrine. This one. It's this one. Nord Wheeler. Okay, well, we should go to the bus stop. Oh, we've got two things happening here. I'll start with oh. this tree seller grew so quickly i'm sure the love you gave did helped it tremendously the laws of this world would allow it well i'm glad the tree is fully grown now i know you'll be able to build some great memories here oh. so i've been doing some thinking all my life i've had to take care of others cooking cleaning taking care of the children oh. they're a blessing really but i've never had any time for excitement adventure I thought, if it's not too much of a hassle, of course, and since we're traveling all over all the time, well, maybe you could come on a little trip with me? Just you and me? It'll be fun, I promise. How about that little hamlet? North Wheeler, was it? From what I heard, it sounds just like my Swedish romance novels. Oh, how I can devour these. What? You're also a fan. I knew you were a woman of culture. Anyway, if we're ever around these parts, I think we could have loads of fun. Okay, Bessie. Now, where to start? Before we start working on the exhibition proper, some preparations are required. Namely, making sure we have access to proper installations. Now, bear with me. Is the boat equipped with some sort of woodworking facility, such as a sawmill? Would have numerous structural applications. Yes? How convenient. A loom would also allow us to make clothing and canvas. Is there one aboard? Fantastic. A foundry with metalworking tools also has a number of applications. Is there anything that could fit the bill? There is a fully functioning boundary. You've got quite a well-furnished ship, Stella. And finally, the cornerstone of any curator's work, a mailbox. Correspondence with my fellow academics and collectors is essential to my work here. You've built a mailbox already? Oh, fantastic. Well, it seems a couple of items are left unchecked. 
I'll let you get to it. This meal is nourishing. Oh, he's hungry! You're in here. Hello? I can get you some food. And a hug! Yeah, I like Gustav. Gustav is kind of fun. and Asher still on your heart? Yeah. So my stomach is rumbling. Yeah, you can have a final meal, bestie. A treat, a dessert, to... and a hug. And then, and then, and then, uh, then it'll be time to say goodbye. We'll just farm. It's fine. We're just doing a little, a little farming, you know. Gotta, gotta, gotta tend to the crops, you know. We're not stalling. I don't know why you'd ever accuse me of something like that. I've, I've never, I've never stalled. I, I wouldn't do that. No. Hi, Alex. <laughs> Let's go, Alex. Thank you. Thanks, Alex. It's fine. It's time to go. We're almost there. Summer, let's do this. <clears throat> Wait, are we there or not? Oh, I have to talk to Summer. Are you ready to go? Thank you. Yeah. Let's go, Summer. It's time. <laughs> it's time. <clears throat> I really thought I could keep up with it this time. The dragon. I was certain it was calming down. I could feel it purring, the warmth of it in my chest. I guess I just did it all over again, just like my father. The dragon is a beast, indomitable if I recall my own words correctly. Whether you choose to care for it, nor to beat it down. Oh, what would Rose think of me? Would she be proud? Would she be ashamed? I can't help but wonder what she would have done in my stead. But I know. I know what she would have told me. She would have looked me straight in the eyes 
Her gaze would have pierced through the veil of my appearance. She wouldn't have said a word. She knew from the beginning. She knew the dragon would take me away. She knew I would have tried to love it and not hate it. Would she have judged me for my failure? I couldn't love it, Stella. I just couldn't. As much as I hate it, it's a part of me now. It will be forever. If I want to leave gracefully, I must accept it for what it is now. I was looking forward to so many more lessons with you. You've been such a gifted student, Stella. I'm so proud of you. So proud of your heart. So proud of your blossoming soul. I'm sorry to leave you. You'll have to learn by yourself. I have no doubt that you'll pull through. The only lesson I have left is to show you what we're made of. Of ephem ephemeral starlight. We're but a few particles of thought on the vast stream of consciousness. This is the last thing I can teach you, Stella. That all things change. That all things end. Goodbye, Summer! I'm so proud of you, Stella. I know Rose would be too. Thank you for everything. Mm. Hug! The final hug! <laughs> Goodbye, Summer. It's time for you to go. Go be with Rose. She is. There's our girl. Among the stars. <laughs> Fantastic coil. Time to get her flower. Oh, I ran right by it. There's her spirit flower. Well. I guess now it's time to go get... The thing. Which means this thing. Which means time to take a bus! Back to our boy, Alex. I can't believe that she's gone. Summer. Yeah. I, I, t I, I almost teared up a little. Oh, almost, he almost got me there. Alright, Alex, let's go, bestie. I don't really need any of those. Yeah, okay, we'll go here. Off we go!
I think we just do a little bit of fishing out here. I'm up and neglecting on the fishing. I really have, you know. <laughs> oh, we also need to check out the jellyfish. I need to remember to do that. We'll do that after the shrine. Is this where, um, Astrid wants to do our little hangout? Yeah! Oh, Stella, thank you so much for bringing me here. Oh, smell that crisp winter air and these colors. Oh, I feel like a young girl again. Oh, let's go already. I can't wait to see all the sights. Let's go, Astrid. Let's, oh, I just said Astrid. Oops, Alice, Alice! We're on the move, Alice! Just you and me! Is that an ancient wooden elevator in a cage? What a wonderful construction! I didn't think I'd ever seen one with my own eyes. Remember? It's by climbing one of these that Ansgar managed to get away from Harold's gang. A treacherous and icy cave that claimed many a young daredevil's life. But of course, Ansgar managed to escape with the Countess's sapphires with ease and grace. Yes, he was quite the cat burglar. Oh, look at me. I'm swooning just thinking about it. As for us, I think we should just climb the ladder. Watch out for ice patches. Okay. Wait, hold on. I can't get that. Let me just, uh... Do this real quick. <laughs> Let me just get the little zip line here. Zip line time. Nice. <laughs> w. Oh, and this statue here, with the bushes ever white? Just as I pictured it, how uncanny. Doesn't it remind you of the shrine where Ansgar offered the sapphires to Agneta? I would have stolen a hundred gemstones and fought a thousand ruffians for the opportunity to gaze upon your beauty. But for a second, oh, how romantic. And then she confessed her love, and then they... Well, you know what happened next. Although in my mind, it wasn't so cold outside. Well, Ansgar sure was hot-blooded. I know that's how he makes me feel. Okay. Who invented winter? I, I don't know. Let me just, uh... How do I get up there? Let me zip line. Oh, in this dark, windy spot? Just like the scaffoldings where Ansgar and Harold dueled. Oh, I can see the scene so clearly. The clacking of the swords, the distant barking of dogs, and whistling of the policemen. Even the smokes remind me of the train station below, and then glinting in the shadows, a small needle-like knife. And just as Ansgar has adeptly disarmed his opponent, the treacherous Igneto emerges and stabs Ansgar in the back. Of course, how could Ansgar know that she was the half-niece of the cruel Harold? The bleeding Ansgar advances haphazardly to the edge of the scaffolding. And he reaches the edge, he glances back, and finds that he's cornered by his opponents, with nowhere to go, but they know it's a matter of time before they can deliver him to Duke Frederick. What is she talking about, chat? What is she talking about? Asgard's long estranged twin brother, and usurper of the family title. But Asgard, held again to his last breath, raises a hand in farewell, smiles softly, and just as he is engulfed by the smoke from the locomotive below. Uh, 
Oh, her favorite romance novel. <laughs> Sorry, yeah, of course. Ouch! Oh, what? Oh, Stella, no, I'm alright, thank you. I'm good, I'm good. Just, I'm a little tired. Let's get back home, okay? Just, let's go. Oh, okay. Are you sure? Yo! Oh my, oh, look at us go, look at us go. <gasps> we made it. We're up top. <gasps> Apple pie. Hold on one second, bestie. I'll be there in a bit. What's up, bestie? Oof, wait up. I'm, I'm tired. Would you, would you mind helping an old lady ba walk back to the tender? Yeah, let's go. It's okay. Let's go, bestie. Come on, sweetheart. I got you. I got you. Let's go, Alice. Yeah, she just needs a little nap. That's all right. See, now we gotta check out all the zip line spots. We gotta go to that the quarry that's in the ice, since we can zip line now. And there are a couple other places that also have zip lines, but I don't know exactly where they are. <coughs> The Calston Mines, that's where we're going. But I also, okay, I'm thinking we go, we go, we go, we go. Bing, bong, bing. That's where we get marble too. That's good, we need that. <coughs> okay, R. Whoop. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Did it wrong, did it wrong, that's fine. No, I did it wrong again. Hold, get it, uh, uh, one more, one more time, one more time. I got, I got it, I got it this time. There we go. Now we got it, now we got it. A letter from Albert. If I could only. R. It's R. Dear valued customer, for a special time, we're running a special promotion, a blueprint, all zip line. Nice. Oh, did I wake everybody up? I don't remember. I don't think I did. Chat, we're about to be able to make some apple pie. Let's freaking go. Also, I still don't know how to make fat. I'm honest, low key, I might just Google it. <laughs> nice, now we got apples. What's up, bestie? Uh -huh. Now that our preparatory work is fully complete, I think it's time to start working on some proper, uh, hold on, huh, hold on. Excuse me, hold on, sorry, sorry.
Oh, we just gotta get all this stuff. Oh, whoops, I missed, I missed, it's fine. Okay. Okay. I think it's time to start working on some proper infrastructure. Ideally, a project of this breadth would require a dedicated space to protect the more fragile pieces of the elements. But it also requires an office desk from which the curator can work comfortably, as well as a waiting area, a front desk, some storage, maybe even a gift shop. But we might manage without one. What? A bit much? On the contrary, Stella, I assure you that all of these are perfectly necessary. Luckily, as a rational man, I realize that space might be an issue. That's why I have thought of a multi-purpose area that would do wonderfully. Let's get to it then, grab a pencil, and listen carefully. A gallery is a paradoxical space, but for it, for both houses, works of art and is one. Architecture is, after all, the first expression of humanity's mastery over nature. As such, it's dark. Uh, eh, what? All right, have you got all that written down? I don't mind going over the finer points of the lecture again. Do you need me to repeat it? Got it. I wanted to have a word with you. We had some fun together with the trip and all, but I can't keep following you around like that. It's just too tiring. And besides, it's not befitting of an old lady like me. Just, has anybody told you how smothering you can be? Please leave me some space now, will you? Can I give her a hug though? I can't believe Alice just called us smothering. Dang, it really do be like that sometimes. Shh, just take them, it's a gift. Okay, I can get you something to eat, bestie. Oh, I forgot. She doesn't have fine dining. Nice. Oh. And a hug. Then we gotta find find the boy a tool. Okay, where's the boy? Oh, he's inside. This boy is always hungry. Is it hug time for him? You know it. <clears throat> Doesn't do carbs, but eats pasta. You know, we don't- we don't ask questions here. Your friend Gwen might be gone, but these jellyfish aren't. That symbol on her door is doing something. It might be the key to fight off those jellyfish. Try it. <clears throat> Lack of food on this vessel is quite depressing. I bet he likes fine dining. This meal is nourishing. Yeah, look at that little hug. All right, give me the, f give me a, give me the fish. I mean the jellyfish. Okay, I really need the green ones. The rest of them don't super matter. I'm not gonna be able to get there in time. Go on, give me another green one. Oh, I don't think I can get that high. There's another one. Can 
No, I can't reach that. Oh, there's a big one. I like fine dining when it's like meat. Fine dining meat, oh, so good. Like a good steak. Woo. Sheesh. Okay, now we can make that one thing. I don't know what it is. I don't remember what, what it is we're supposed to be making. Is it an improvement? Oh yeah, it's this guy. Nice. Okay, now we need... What is this? Fireflies? Oh. Where are we? We're gonna stop here and then we'll go to the quarry. Actually, we'll probably end up going to the quarry tomorrow. This will probably be the last thing we do today. Let's check out these fireflies. Fireflies in the field when you live in the mountains. We used to get fireflies in the summer when I where I grew up. I don't know that this area that I'm living in now would have fireflies. Who's the pink? Oh, you might have noticed Alice, but you might have noticed, but Alice, well, she seems to have some trouble getting around, doesn't she? I don't think she can use ladders anymore. I'm not sure she'd tell you, but I think she's stuck up there. Maybe you could move her house down to the deck level? I'm sure that would help her. Yeah, I can do that. Which one's ass? This one? <clears throat> Bye, Blackout! What is that? Do you hear that, Stella? Is that music? An organ? Strings? How incredibly stirring. How dark and mysterious. Oh, what beauty. So would you mind letting the music in? It would mean so much to me. Let the notes flow through you, Stella. Let the music strike straight to your heart. What? <clears throat> what? Interesting. Look at him playing the violin over here. Where are the red ones? Look at all these fireflies. This is funky. <clears throat> all right, little bugs, let's do this. Oh my gosh, there's just so many of these little guys. Uh, that might be too high. We'll go for this one.
Oh, I missed him. Ah. Now this is where you get the big bucks. You just run in the packs of fireflies. How long is this, bestie? There it is. I was like, gosh dang. So where do we plant that? In the garden. Is that here? Interesting. All right, chat. <clears throat> it's that time. It's that time. We're at the two hour mark. You already know. Thank you guys for coming in. It was a great stream, great time. somebody to raid for the Friday night vibe oh I know who we'll go say hi to come join the raid chat join the raid let's go say we're gonna go say hi to Joe we're gonna go say hi to Joe I will probably see you all on like Sunday I think uh, that's probably when I'll be back. No promises. I'm trying to get back into the schedule, but uh, life do be happening, you know? It just be like that. All right, I will see you guys all around. Bye everybody, thanks for coming. This was fun. I definitely did not almost cry at summer, definitely. I would never, I never, and no, I would never do that. <laughs>